I'm gonna start off by priming my face and I'm using the Wet n Wild Coverall Primer. You guys, this is my absolute favorite primer. It doesn't have like that silicone feeling. It actually feels like lotion, which I absolutely love. Next, I'm gonna be color correcting my face and I'm using the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color orange. I'm gonna be applying this to all the areas of hyperpigmentation on my face. I'm going to be using a pretty lightweight foundation here, so I want to make sure all of my areas of concern are covered and concealed before I apply that foundation. If you're wondering if I'm using a damp beauty blender here, I am not, but I highly recommend doing so. Um, I kind of had a hard time spreading this concealer on my face, so you definitely want to use a dampened beauty blender. So here I'm mixing my L'Oreal True Match Foundation with the True Match Lumi Liquid Glow Illuminator. This is just going to make my foundation glow and I also chose to use the L'Oreal True Match Foundation because it has a really lightweight finish. It also looks really natural which is kind of the look that I'm going for here. So now I'm taking the Inglot Face and Body Illuminator and I'm applying that to all the areas where I would normally highlight. As you can see, it's just going to add an even more glowy finish to my face. I absolutely love this product. It's amazing. And now I'm just going to blend it out. Now I'm taking the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the color Fun and I'm highlighting my face. So now I'm taking the Sasha Buttercup Setting Powder and I'm setting those areas that I highlighted. You guys, I absolutely love this setting powder. It now I'm priming my eyes and I'm using the NYX Eyeshadow Primer in the color Nude. And I'm taking my 35C Morph palette and I'm taking like this golden nude shade and I'm just sweeping it over my eyelid. Taking the same palette, I'm taking this orange and this like brown bronzy color and I am sweeping that into my crease just to add depth. I'm also sweeping it a little bit under my waterline as well and then messily blending it up towards my eyebrow. Now I'm taking my Naked Basics palette in the color Venus and I'm brushing that up on my eyebrow just to add some highlight. I'm also taking that same color and adding that to my inner tear duct just to open up my eyes and you know make me look more awake. I'm going in with my Maybelline Master Graphic Eyeliner Pen and I'm lining my eyes. I'm not doing like a special wing liner or anything like that, I'm just lining my eyes. Now I'm taking my Kiss Number 11 Falsies and applying them to my eyelashes. I'm gonna blend my Falsies with my real lashes with the L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara. Then I'm setting my foundation with my Makeup Forever Powder, which I absolutely love. This is also gonna add a little bit of color to my face too. Kinda give me that bronzy, glowy look. A little contour on my nose. And now I'm taking the CoverGirl Queen Collection Ebony Bronzer and I am contouring my face. Right 
I am taking the Milani Baked Blush in the color Red Vino and I'm just lightly brushing that over the area that I contoured just to kind of like gradually add that color. I want it to be really soft and pretty. And now I am just blending all of the powders together. Next, I'm taking my e.l.f. Baked Blush and I'm applying that to the bridge of my nose just to add that glow and to highlight that area even more. And I am taking my All Around Glow Bronzer by Ruby Kisses and I'm applying that to the high areas of my face. This is what's really going to add that sun-kissed glow here and that's the look that I'm going for. Like I want to look like I just fell out of heaven. See? Now I'm taking my NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream in the color Dubai, which is my absolute favorite, and I'm applying that to my lips. I'm taking the NYX Wonder Pencil here and I'm lining my waterline. This is also gonna help my eyes to open up. Applying a little bit of mascara. And I am taking my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Setting Spray and I'm done. Make sure to thumbs up this video, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.